In this module, we'll show how to depressurize and refill media on a dome hole tank. The symptoms include a pressure drop on pH modification filters or a pressure drop on carbon backwashing units. To replenish media in a dome hole filter system, we first need to depressurize the system. Please reference our videos regarding this topic. Once the system has been depressurized, we then need to remove the cap from the dome hole system. Number one is with the slotted screwdriver, finger and thumb knobs on the outside, or a 9 16th nut and ratchet assembly. Once loosened, pull straight out and check to make sure that there is no damage to the O-rings. We can then put in our funnel to replenish our media. Refill the media to the correct capacity. Making sure all media is inside the unit, you then remove the funnel and clean out the opening. Making sure that no media is left. We then inspect the O-rings to make sure there is no media on there, wiping it down. We then re-lubricate the O-rings with Pentair approved silicone lubricant. Once the O-rings are lubricated, we put the cap back in and rotate until we see the lines on the cap align with those on the tank. At this point, the unit is refilled and ready to be repressurized. We then bring our bypass tool back in, slowly open the unit to repressurize. Once it is fully open, the unit is back in service. Good luck and thanks for watching.